my loves. Oh, it's me, Captain Snotty Pants. Right, I'm going to do these nails on myself extremely long. Let's get going. I'm going to use the Glitter Planet Easy Tips <clears throat> because they are super duper easy and quick to apply. And they give you such a beautiful stiletto. Um, and I'm going to keep them full length. So I've lined them up. Now I've got Diddy Nails. And even on my pinky, the smallest one is a bit too big. So I'm just going to customise the tip. I'll show you quickly how I do that. I literally just take a file that's been used because I don't want it too gritty. And I just bring down the edges slightly. That's all. And then just keep matching it up. What I do on one side, I do on the other side. And then I'll just check it against my nail. And once I'm happy with that. I'll go in and apply. Now I'm using my Angel Crystals adhesive. The trick with this adhesive is to use the tiniest amount. <clears throat> a lot of times students will come and use it and they can't, they're like, it's not sticking. It's, you need to use the smallest amount, literally a teeny weeny little bit, and then it'll stick really quickly. Oh, we'll just place that on. Oh, I nearly put it that way around. Not good, because I can't see the way the finger's going. So I'll just place it, hold it for a few seconds, and then that's that. So I'll fast forward to all of them being stuck on, so you don't have to watch me stick them all on. There we are. And I'm going to customise the shape ever so slightly. I'm just going to file in the edges and just blend in that little adhesion line. So there you go, I've just made them a little bit more pointy, that's all. I'm happy with that. I've got the sniffles, I'm so sorry. Okay, so I'm gonna dehydrate and prime. Guys, I am so excited. I have got exclusive access to vlog. Um, can I tell you this now? Yes, I can. Yes, I can, because it will be, it will be released in time, okay. I'm going to be vlogging at Shorovsky headquarters in London, in central London, on Monday, because I am there for educator training. Me and a handful of other techs from the UK, just a handful of people, have been given the opportunity to be official educators for Shorovsky which means so much. I'm so excited. Right, anyway, back to the nails. I'm using Nailmate Monomer Nailmate Clear for my base. I'm just gonna apply a clear base on every nail. So yes, I will be vlogging from London. Obviously, the, when I'm training, it's a bit difficult, but I will do as much as I can for you guys. Keep an eye on my Instagram. I'll be updating my stories. Um, yeah, I'm super excited. Right, let's get this clear base done on all of those nails. Okie dokie. 
Now, this stunning Valentino powder here is called Excite Me. And it's like a soft white. It's not even white. It's just, oh, it's so stunning. And this is Soft Touch. Excite Me is like Soft Touch with gold. That one, I think, I can't remember the name. I can't remember the name, but I'll let you know. And I'm using some pigment powder from Glitterati and some flakes that I don't know where they're from. This is the Valentino colour that I'm using and I need to, I'll put the name in the description box because I can't remember it. It's literally five o'clock in the morning and I'm laid in bed ill, so. <laughs> I'm just going to place that bead at the cuticle and make it neat and then drag it down. Add some of the flakes and then start alternating between this colour, Excite Me, which is that soft, kind of off-white with the gold flecks of glitter in it's so beautiful and um, the pigment and soft touch and we're gonna make a cloudy galaxy now like cloudy and gorgeous so I'll let you watch this Now we're going to do the same on this nail. Um, what I didn't mention, I, I should mention, is I keep my layers super thin. We're literally painting now. Just keep it super, super thin. Otherwise you're going to end up with a really, really bulky nail. So everything you do, you keep it thin and you build it up bit by bit. It's much easier to build it up than it is to get rid of it. Um... And don't for, don't be afraid to like layer things over the top of each other and see what effect you get. Mash things together, see what effect you get. It's all about that kind of cloudy look, that galaxy look. So yeah, I'll do the same on this now and then I'll be back. Some way I 
of our shoulders The fight isn't over Can you let me be, be tonight? I will need some time alone Not forever But when we're together It feels like my spark's been left in the dark sometimes Cause when I'm with you it's just like an airway Not sure, but I'm probably right When you're around, I can say What I wanna say So hard to concentrate This is all that I need and more Perfectly safe and sure took some weight of our shoulders so this fight is over can you stay with me me tonight i don't want to be alone and i need you here if you want to i know my spark's been left in the dark sometimes but when i'm with you it's just like an airplane Not sure, but I'm probably right When you're around, I can say What I wanna say So hard to concentrate Now then On the middle finger, this is going to be a full nail of that beautiful Valentino colour Because we're going to do A seriously big bling design So I'll add the Valentino colour and then on top of that I will add those beautiful flakes that I've got. So I'm breaking it up into a few beads because it's a very, very long nail. Don't need to add a lot of bulk, just make sure the colour's opaque in the way you want it and then that's all you need really. And we're just going with another bead. And I'll keep doing that until the nail is completely full of colour. You make me nervous. I think I might be hooked on you. I love the things you said, you said to me, to me, it seems like you like me too. Can take it slow, make sure we do this right. Cancelled all my plans to be with you tonight. Tonight, so just sit with me, talking to the night until the morning, building can mystery. Another way to say this, but I think, I think we were meant to be. You make me anxious. I think I might be stuck on you. I love the things you did, you did for me, for me. It seems like you're dropping clues. There's no need to rush, so let's just take our time. Dropping everything, cause you're stuck on my mind. My mind. Then I'll just pick up a small bead of the clear acrylic and dip it in those flakes, which I am pretty much almost out of now. I'm so sad. And I'm just going to cover the whole nail in those.
Now, the rest of the nails are exactly the same, so I won't show those because we've got so much to get through. So I'm going to show you how I've capped the first two. I'm just going to show you how I cap this nail so that you can see. But again, it's going to be the same on every nail. So I'm just getting a generous bead of the crystal clear acrylic from Nailmate because that's my core system. And I'm just making sure I tuck it in there and then cover that whole design all the way down the nail and then I'm going to check my lines down the barrel of the nail from the side of the nail and just make sure it's looking even it's looking like I've got a big enough apex like everything's covered remember with glitters if it ain't matte it ain't capped so you need to make sure you've got enough clear so that when you file your design you're not going to file away the glitter and everything like that so enough to give you a strong structure and you know you're not going to end up with any kind of bald spots once you've um once you've filed so I'll just keep on with that until I'm happy with it and then I'll let them set up and I'll file them off camera because we've got so much crystal design work to do so we just don't have time to show filing as well it would just be insane here we are all filed look at that aren't they gorge love them they're so long but I love them Right, we've got a ton of bling now to do. Because it don't mean a thing if you ain't got your bling. This gel I'm using is called Wonder Woozy Gel. It was sent to me. It's really good stuff. Right, first crystals are the Rivoli AB. They are a pointy back. They're like discs. They come in two sizes. This is the smaller size. So I'm going to lay this thick gel. A good gel would be Valentino Gem Gel as well, which is also available from Angel Crystals. All of this stuff is. All Valentino and all my Swarovski stuff is available from Angel Crystals. And I'll put my discount code in the description. Don't forget to use it. People keep going, oh, I forgot. Oh, God, I could have saved myself some money. So don't forget. So I'm just using these three crystals into that thick gel. It's designed to hold stuff together so it can deal with it it's specifically for that job I'm checking it with the other hand and then once I'm happy it's going straight in that lamp and this goes in for 180 seconds when it's this particular brand then I'm using a B shut on back so pointy back round crystals they're all real Swarovski and absolutely gorgeous and I'm going to fill these little crevices with that thick gel and then push those crystals into it so that we're covering all the gaps don't want them catching on anyone's hair and we just want as much bling as we can physically fit in as well really so just get it all in there I'll put some at the back as well. Super thick gel. <laughs> See what I mean? I'm hooking it into the gap, not over the crystals, but into the little gap. Then we'll pop those um, pointy backs in there. That's me trying to deal with long nails. <laughs> That's going in the lamp. Just making sure it's nice and even and it matches the other hand. Then when that's cured, look how blingy that is. We're gonna get on with our flat back crystals in a second. We're just going to fill in the little gaps here with the gel because you don't want holes and gaps you just want to make sure they've got that gel sealing them securing them it will keep your cluster together so I'm literally going around with my little brush 
and just every little bit that I can see that's a little gap I'm going to put this thick gel in to kind of secure everything in and then I'll cure that in my lamp Right, so flat backs. I'm using these flat back AB diamonds and my crystal adhesive from Angel Crystals. This stuff is amazing. You just gotta know how to use it. Oh, so I've just applied that. Sorry, it was off camera. That's so annoying. Now I'm using my fan, AB fan crystals. Right, you'll be able to see now. I just use a small amount of glue. You do not need a lot. I promise you, less is more. The more you use, the more those crystals will just move about. You apply a small amount they'll grip amazingly so I'm just going to make sure that's exactly where I want it sometimes it's easier to get your hands on it and do the same on the other side get that fan crystal in there it's hard doing it with long nails there we are okay now Let's follow that down. So I'm going to add some AB kites. I need to go crystal shopping. I'm going to go there while I'm in London because I am low on crystals. And I'm going to add the kite either side. Just making sure there is enough glue around there. And then I'm going to add three AB raindrops. These are the small ones. I think this might be my favourite crystal design so far, actually. I love it. It's so pretty. Sorry. I can't stop bloody sniffing. It's so pretty. The crystal tool and everything is from Angel Crystals as well. Okay, look at that. Now we're not finished because I need to do some on my pinky finger. Just so we've got a little bit more bling. So on my pinky finger, I'll show you. These is, this is what comes in the round AB multi-pack. You get five sizes of round AB flat back crystals. Five sizes. I've used nearly all my teeny ones. So I'm just going to do one of each going down in size. So when you look at those mix bags and you look at the AB mix bag, you get five sizes in that. It's such good value for money. Plus you get 5% off with the code Sarah B 5 So you see, yeah, that's such good value for money. For the quality as well. Damn, they're good. So they will just go down in size. Okie dokie. So they are all blinged up now. Look at that. Oh my god. Now we're going to top coat. Nail mate, super gloss. I am. Um, oh my god, I'm speechless watching this. It's so pretty. When I do these nails, I flash cure them because I don't want the top coat moving about and flooding the cuticle. 
<clears throat> because I have to go in around crystals and it takes a while. Don't ever go over your... I see people sometimes slopping top coat over their crystals and I just want to cry. Although they're not using, like, decent crystals, so I suppose it doesn't really make much difference. But with these ones, damn, don't do it. Don't do it. See what I mean about them being, like, cloud galaxy nails? They're just so gorge. Oh, look at that. I'm in love. Quick 10 second flash cure and we'll move on to the next layer. Now with this one, I'll do the bottom first and I'll butt it up under the crystals as much as I can. Then I'll come in with my detailer brush and start filling the gaps. And if there's deeper gaps, I'll add more top coat. It doesn't matter, we just keep building it up. Be mindful not to lose the shape of the nail down the side walls. But you, you'll know anyway if you just keep looking at it and keep your eye on it. Just bit by bit. And then we'll just tuck it in all the way. And again, on this nail, we'll flash cure once it's um once it's been top coated, so that we don't run the risk of um, flooding the cuticle area or losing the shape of the nail. Just so much sparkle going on. It's like oh. <laughs> in around those top crystals I still can't believe I managed to do this with my left hand on the other hand like it's nuts it's amazing what the brain can learn isn't it so I'm tucking it in there in the crevices I'm not putting it on the crystals I'm, there's a gap a little gap and I'm just making sure that it has some top coat in it in it bruv <laughs> just making sure it has that top coat in it Okay, index finger, which is just going to be plain beauty all on its own. Oh, so pretty. So pretty. And then I'll do a nice shot of the thumb now, because the thumb is the same as the finger with all the crystals on so now you can see really what that beautiful um, colour from Valentino looks like with those flakes on top of it super pretty <laughs> oh so gorgeous Right, I'll get those cured in my lamp, apply some cuticle oil, and here's the finished nails. I really hope you've liked this video. Wish me luck managing my nails this long. I'm off to London to become a Shrofsky educator. I will uh, see you in my vlog. Tally bye!